Hey guys, welcome back to Island Vibe Cooking. In today's video, I am going to show you guys how to make candied strawberry without a thermometer. If you're new here, don't forget to subscribe, like the video, and comment down below. Without further ado, let's get started. You will need one cup of sugar, four tablespoons of corn syrup, four tablespoons of water, one teaspoon of vanilla extract, and of course the strawberry, as well as some food coloring, red in color. Now we're going to get started. Pour your water in the pot. Next, we're going to add the corn syrup. Now I am going to add the sugar in. Now be sure you are using your heat on low because you don't have a thermometer. So keep it on very low, just a little bit for it to kind of boil just a little bit. Now time to add the vanilla extract. Now if you have to, you can remove it off the, the stove. Just keep the temperature very low. Now I am going to add my food coloring. We're going to give it a quick mix. You can add as much as you want, but just don't overdo it. Now I am going to put it back on the stove. Keep in mind we're cooking this on low or medium low. It depends on your stove. Now once your syrup is nice and thick, you're going to use a stick to poke the strawberry and we're going to candied these strawberries you guys. Just dip your strawberry in the syrup. It's nice and thick. It works better when it's hot, so don't wait. Just twirl it. Let it drip for a little bit. Now, as you guys can see, I am using baking sheets. Be sure you spray your baking sheets before you add the candied strawberry on there because you will see why later in this video. Just repeat the process and this is how they should look after. They look so nice and they taste amazing to you guys. Now I am going to try it for you guys. They look really, really pretty. Let me know down below if you're going to try this. It's really, really fun to do. But don't get burned. <laughs> Now this is why I tell you guys to spray your baking sheets before you start making this because it will stick on there. And they were really, really crispy and crunchy. Thank you for watching. Do not forget to leave your comment down below. Thumbs up the video and I'll see you guys on my next video. Bye.